Hey guys, welcome back. I hope you all are doing really well. So today we have a what's on my bag video. I don't think I have done this on my channel ever. I mean, I have done a boxing of course, but this is like for me something new. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you might have seen already the bag that I'm gonna be talking to you guys about. And yes, is the Lueve mini basket bag um now this one comes in other sizing i believe there's like a extra large one which is insane but to me i kind of like like the more small and practical um it's kind of like the vibe when i search for bags um now first thing first i want to talk about why i decided to buy a designer woven bag or rattan bag um I generally love these types of bags I have always have plus I feel like I find a lot of ways to style it so the question is do you need a designer um, wooden bag no but if you love them and you want to invest on one then I'm sure that I would say probably yes now this one actually retails um, about $450 so it's quite pricey for what it is now I have some pros and cons which I'm gonna talk to you guys throughout this video um, so first thing first I want to start with what I love about this bag I think in general is the shade um, it's very neutral so for example if you are like me that loves to wear a lot of black white beige cream uh, dark blue I feel like this bag will go great with it and I love the fact that even though that it is quite casual um, I still feel like you can put this with like a gown um, I always have seen these types of bags so Parisian and I think that's why I love it like I feel myself like with a blazer some loafers some big sunnies and this and I think like it's gonna look incredible chic now I love Lueve in general um, uh, I think it's the which one is it I think it's the puzzle bag It's one of their most um, best sellers now that one retails about three thousand dollars which is insane um, so I think I'm happy with this one now there are other styles if you're not particularly love with like a really open basket bag um, which they do uh, but but I really love this one I, I think it's just the shape and the style uh, so I think uh, when it comes to what I can fit in it I'm happy with it because I can fit a lot which that is quite in a way I'm almost contradicting myself because I don't like like really huge canvas bags because sometimes I feel like I lost everything in there but with this one because it isn't so deep I think that's why I feel like it's great because I can find everything so easily which in another note it can be a con um, uh, but I think in general what I love is the style of the bag I think that's why I got it and I know that I'm gonna wear it a lot which that um, makes me quite happy because I see always that um, cost of wear there which that in a way uh, doesn't make me feel guilty about spending that much on these types of bags so now um, let's start with the cons the first one is the fact that it peels like when you have constantly contact with your body um, you're gonna see like little shreds of the woven so basically you're gonna have to use some scissors and cut them out a little bit which that obviously kills it for me um, but it was gonna happen is a natural um, bag which it makes a lot of sense and uh, obviously the second thing which I already mentioned you guys is the fact that this is an open bag which means that everyone is gonna see your shit in it so it isn't the safest one like even though that I can put this like really close to myself um, there still is a lot of room for someone to put your hand on it and grab something so it does come with a dust bag which I think it can be maybe so a little bit safer if you put things on it but other than that I definitely suggest to put your basically like your more important things really down and then put things on top of it so you can hide it a little bit so it almost feels like a beach bag in a way but to me I think because of the leather obviously the Lueve logo makes it a little bit quite different um, but other than that I think I'm happy with what I got so let me show you what actually I can fit in this okay so let's start getting things from this bag first thing first let me see if I can do this so I can show you as you guys can see it's quite spacious which is perfect because there's so much there's so much room for everything which 
that's why I associate it like for example like with a beach bag so let me get the bigger things first thing first my bullet journal um, I always have it with me I am that type of girl who still likes to write notes so I always find it like super practical to bring this with me plus if I have notes or things or videos or posts that I'm thinking about I always like to write them in here the other thing that I got are antibacterial wipes. I think that is a must today. Of course, my Celine sunglasses, which I have this one, which are the 55 millimeter in rectangular. I always love the shape of this and it's really easy to carry on, which I love. Then of course, sanitizer, which is quite squishy, but um, it's just because it has been on the bag, but always now in days it is an essential. Um, then I do have the book that I'm reading right now and this one is from Stephen King um, it's called La Sangre Manda um, which is basically is four short stories I think I have another book from him that it is the same if you're interested I kind of like fiction when it comes to reading I like like that escapism um, and I like thrillers psychological thrillers it's kind of like my vibe when it comes to book and this one in particular from Stephen King love it because there are um, four different types of story I'm still reading the first one which is actually called the telephone of Mr. Harrigan I believe and then it has another one which is called Rad I mean it has a few of them they're quite um, um, very easy to read and they're kind of like the thing that I live for when it comes to book I have promised myself to read a book a month and I think I'm doing it quite well so yes this is the one that I'm reading and I typically like to carry on with me if I am on a doctor's appointment if I am just taking my car to have a checkout so I kind of like to always read because it's one of my favorite hobbies to do and then of course pills I suffer always from headaches I think it's because of the heat so I always have pills with me um, I have a roller perfume. I got this one from Sephora. This one is from the brand Clean and this one is the Fresh Laundry Scent. I always have loved roll-ups. I think they're so like old school but I love them. And this one smells just like that. And I love the fact that this one is very safe to put on your purse and it's so thin. I have always loved these types of perfume just to put on my bags. Um, another one that I love from them I think is the next one. I don't remember. I know that it is like black with like, I don't know if it's like lavender, but it's really beautiful. And this ones I always get them in Sephora. Then of course my car keys. And then this is my wallet which i know that is huge um this is from louis vuitton it wanna is one of their coin purses i have had these for so many years now so the stability on these types of bags it's insane um, now this one i love the fact that i can put my house keys because i'm that forgetful so i always leave my keys behind and i feel like with this i have to be reminded of two things so i think definitely i'm not gonna leave one against the other um i'm gonna do later on my channel um like some suggestions to start buying designer bags um, I'm gonna talk to you a little bit more about this ones but here obviously I have my credit cards some cash and then finally is where I keep mostly my lipstick now I used to travel with concealer foundation and all of that now in days I'm like more minimal when it comes to that like I don't like to splatter my face with makeup when I already have makeup so typically I like to carry for example my lipstick if I'm going out eat something grab coffee which is typically what I like to retouch nowadays and this one is from new stick which you guys have seen it and in here I keep basically the lipsticks that I typically wear now I always get a lot of questions about the lipsticks that I use I typically mix a lot of them um, so for example like I like to mix my new stick lip and cheek which I have today which is in the shade and ties with my Maybelline um, color sensational lipstick in the shade clay crush and I love the fact of how new stick lipsticks comes because it has a mirror and then you can put other things on it and then I love the fact that you're not gonna um, cover your bag with lipstick because trust me I have done that so many times and I have learned the lesson I wanted to keep it pristine so now this is the interior of the bag like this is my hand so this is what I'm telling you guys that I feel like it is deep but it isn't like 
crazy deep. I love also the fact that it has some um, Lueve details right here, which I think that makes it like extra. And also, I love the fact that you can definitely put um, the strings, like you can make them longer or shorter. So it does adjust um, to your needs, which I love. And it doesn't weigh a lot. Now, it has this weird shape, which I don't know if you guys can see, but it's like bigger here and shorter here, which obviously it is a design that is made. Um, and then below, of course, it's quite simple. So it isn't like that, like perfectly done bag, but then again, it's done in a natural way, which it makes sense. And um, I generally love it. And it doesn't weigh anything, of course. So I think it's perfect of what it is. And I'm so happy that I got my first Lueve bag and it was this one. So definitely, it's gonna have a lot of wear, I know, and I can tell. Um, so yep guys, like always, everything is going to be linked below, um, as well as some other alternative wicker or straw bags if you guys want to get into this groove. Um, I generally love these types of bags and um, yeah, let me know if you love them as well. And like always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next week with a video. Bye.